What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another episode of Jimmy Simulator 24. Uh, last episode, we got uh, the second floor all added in. And um, also, we got... Or no, I think we did that the uh, previous episode. I can't remember now. Yeah, I think it was the previous episode. But uh, we got the... Uh, we purchased the boxing club. And um, we got... I know last episode, we got all of our locker rooms set up in here. So this episode, we are going to get... Um, the upstairs all set up, reorganized and everything, because we're actually going to kind of change how this is all laid out. You got, uh, some of you guys has had, uh, suggested in the comments to, um, set this up as the, like, aerobics type area up down here, and then upstairs will be, like, the cardio area type of thing, um, for us to, uh, do all that. So, we'll stock up on a little bit of that. I was waiting until the uh, end of the day so we could actually pick up and collect everything, and we're not affecting, um... Basically, people trying to work out and everything in the uh, during the daytime when they're actually here, trying to enjoy their time. <laughs> but um, I also I picked up the last the last couple of the uh, yoga mats here. It seemed to fix our problem with everyone getting stuck right here, which uh, you guys saw in uh, previous episodes. So I think um, that was it. So I probably should have done that a while ago, honestly, because that was causing some issues. But um, so I'm gonna go ahead and start picking up a bunch of stuff here, and uh, we're gonna get. Everything all nice and redone, laid out. I think um, we got uh, Biscuit, good boy, sitting here. Uh, still just chilling with us. Uh, but yeah, like I said, we're going to get all this stuff picked up and uh, redo all of this. Um, Come on, where are you going? There you are. Okay, so I think what I'm kind of thinking here is I'm going to keep the front window all or the front wall all open here. So nice view in, nice view out. Um, and then we're not having issues with people walking around how they are. With that, I'm thinking probably setting up maybe a, a line of yoga mats on the back wall over there. And then maybe like a bunch of the, uh, let's see here, a bunch of the stationary bikes. And then everything else, I, w I originally I was going to put the row machine and the treadmills down here. But I think everything else, it's it's going to go um, upstairs. So I think it's just going to be like a row of uh, bikes. And then, like I said, a, um, a row of uh, uh, yoga mats right in here. And so I did play through a full day. We got 72,000, you guys can see up in the top right. Um, that way we just, we just had enough money to be able to do everything that uh, we want to do here. And uh, we're not having to wait around for uh, money to be coming in or anything. And then, like I said, we're not getting in people's ways during the uh, during the day. So let's, um, if you guys are enjoying these videos, make sure to hit that like button also. If you guys are new around here, make sure to click that subscribe button uh, so you guys don't miss out on any videos that I'm posting. And... Um, we're also on the road to 1,000 subscribers sometime early next year, hopefully. And um, trying to keep the channel growing here. But uh, you guys seem to be really enjoying the videos, so thank you all very much for all the support um, that all of the uh, videos are getting. It's absolutely insane. We're slowly getting away from the wall there, but that's all right. But yeah, like I said, it's absolutely insane. All the love and support you guys have been giving the uh, videos in the channel. It's amazing, so thank you all very much for that. The um, We gained a ton of subscribers over the last few days, even. Um, you guys absolutely crushed our goal of 300 and now we actually might even hit 350 uh, before the end of the year, which is insane. So, but um, not going to push too hard for that because I know um, we only got a few days at the time of recording this. It's the 28th today, so we only have three days left, which I mean, it's possible. I think we're at like 320 right now at the time of recording this. So, I mean, it is possible to get another 30 within a few days. I know you guys have done that in close to a day before, so. Uh, we're going to get a couple more of these. So yeah, like I said, thank you all very much for all the love and support. It just, it means so much to me. I don't deserve it, but you guys are absolutely killing it. So thank you all. Oh, uh, let's see here. I'm going to try to slowly get back towards the wall a little bit. And um, I actually might have purchased the right amount of mats. There we go. Look at that. Yeah, it looks pretty nice. I know that kind of leaves some open floor space for us, which I kind of want to do with things. We're getting a little cramped before, which I'm not a big fan of. So let's uh, get some more of these uh, stationary bikes placed in then. Like I said, we're going to go kind of nice and spread out with stuff since we have so much more space now. There's no need to really get super cramped with stuff. Um, do I have? Yep, I got a couple more. I really wish that these would just like all stack together. I think it'd be a lot nicer if that was the case. But I don't know, maybe we'll do a second row of them. Maybe uh, try to fill in some space, because I guess, I mean, looking at it like this, like we're going to have a lot of wide open space. So, <laughs> um, I don't know. We'll we'll see. I know I'm, I'm trying to get uh, as many people in here as we can. I think we have like 130 members 
at this time. You guys were telling me uh, when you guys commented saying that we can actually take a look at our um, members, which I knew. But um, you guys are also, which you, you're right. Um, I can see our estimated daily earnings um, from all that. But yeah, we actually um, we actually have almost 140 members, which I didn't realize their memberships actually have a timestamp, basically, of what how much time is left on um, on their membership, which I didn't know that until coming in looking in here. I think it was like just before last episode, I when I recorded it, I had taken a look at that. But um, yeah, we are going to get. Some more of these placed down. Our our maintenance man's going to be ripping, pulling his hair out with <laughs> how much stuff, how much equipment we are going to have for him to repair and <laughs> be repairing all the time and keeping up to date. So I think I think there's a lower level uh, maintenance person that I might have to hire uh, for this. But um, how are we looking with that? We're going to need probably one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we're going to need like six or seven more for that row. And like I said, I think I might end up doing a second row. Honestly. So I might end up just purchasing. Well, maybe I'll leave that just for now because we might run out of money, honestly, if we keep purchasing a bunch of equipment. So I might uh, just do one row for the time being. So one, two, three, four, five, six. I'll go seven just so we have one in case. I think I might need seven. And I'm, like I said, I'm not packing these in too tight. I'm trying to kind of um, keep things a little more uh, open and. Nice walkways and stuff for people to be able to use and enjoy. That way it's not like, because I mean, we had these like tight to each other before. So like I said, I'm not, uh, not trying to do that to people. Want to leave, keep things nice and nice and uh, open area for everyone. Keep them for space further away from all the creepers. There we go. Perfect. Okay. So we were able to get 14 in there. Like I said, I know it's like pretty wide open now. We've got a lot of open space. So yeah, I probably will do a second row. And I don't know. I guess it, it does look a little funny having just this wide open space. But we got a bunch of yoga mats. Maybe we'll do a second row of yoga mats. I don't know. I don't really want to take up a bunch of space with stuff. But uh, let's head on upstairs here. I know we've still got our equipment pile, our old equipment, <laughs> just stashed over there in the corner. I'm trying to just make it easier for like what I already have here. Like this is all stuff we're going to be placing down. Because everything is tier 3 except for like these machines in here because they were new equipment at the time that we wanted to add in. So also I think I'm going to add another uh, two vending machines and a garbage can out here. So I'm going to go get these real quick because I think we're going to put those right up by the top of the stairs. We got one of those and then we got two of these in there. Which we will get uh, all these stocked up here in just a bit. Yeah I think this is a good spot for all this to go right in here. So we'll go with the garbage can like right there and then let's go with I kind of wish that there was more machines like we got actually quite a bit of space for stuff like this. So let's go like that space it off the wall just a little bit so it's not just tight to the wall. Don't need to we got a ton of space there. But yeah I don't know I'm thinking maybe we'll do like the we have so much extra space now it's actually kind of crazy. Hmm. Yeah, I think uh, what we'll do here is we're going to go with some uh, treadmills like this. Like I said, we're going to go, we're going to give them ample space. That way they're not all like cramped tight together. We got uh, some more to place down here. We got some nice views of the cities that people walking by. So that's pretty sweet. Uh, yeah, we got a bunch more to do here. Yeah, I really wish that these just all stacked together. I mean, I get why it's not because they have different durability to like what, how much is damaged, but it's just also kind of a little bit annoying because like we're trying to just be placing a bunch of stuff down, which I guess normally isn't a huge issue being that um, you're not doing this all the time, but um, it would be kind of nice if, um, if they were just all stacked together. So there we go. We got all that in. I think that's the last one that we have. Which, honestly, I mean, we got space. Maybe we'll add a couple more to there. Maybe we'll do like one, two, three, maybe four more. Probably not because I don't. Want, I want to keep the walkway kind of open too. But maybe we'll add like two more or three more. But, um, okay. Let's, uh, we're going to add, I think, some of the weights to like the back wall over here. Which, again, we might end up adding more of these in here. Because, I mean, we're going to need to fill in a bunch of space. 
So we got that. Actually, these weights and stuff should probably go... Actually, yeah, I'm going to pick this back up. I kind of want the weights to go on this wall because we don't need a ton of space for these, but we're going to have a bunch of other equipment that uh, would be great to get up against the back wall. So let's... I think I'm going to reserve this wall for the um, like dumbbell sets here. For this, I'm going to move this move these closer to the wall that way once we get all that stuff picked up but i think i'm just going to get these set down right in here just for the time being and then like i said we'll kind of more maybe add maybe i'll actually keep what keep those there and we'll just add another one right there and then um we have something else that's similar not really okay but yeah i think like i said we've got a bunch of like bigger equipment that would be suited great to, to have by the wall, like this kind of stuff. Because it needs quite a bit of floor space. And then um, it's not taking up uh, window spots as well. So let's uh, do this. We're going to place that right there. Actually, you know what? I'm going to move these over just a little bit. Because these have been always kind of cramped up in the corner by stuff. Because there is uh there is a need to get technically there's a need to do stuff like out from there and same with behind. Well, I'm not really behind, I guess, because the weights you switch right here. I'm used to like machines where you like go to the backside to switch the uh, weight weight selection around. But uh yeah, let's get get these placed in here. Again, we're gonna we're gonna space it out, leave ample room around. It's not really very much ample room, but <laughs> Uh, it works. Okay. Let's, uh, we got a couple of these lat pull downs. Which, honestly, I might add, like, two more of these in. That's where, like, I'm trying to add more equipment and also keep stuff organized here. So. Let's, uh, let's do that. So, equipment. And this is why I'm redoing all this, so that way we can, and that's why also, also why I saved up a bunch of money. So we can actually, um... Purchase a bunch of new equipment as well to fill in some more of the space and add in so we can get more people in here and have them all be be happies. Okay. Let's go like this. There we go. We got that one. Why are these rotating back? Okay. There we go. So we got all that in. Let's do... Um, I think, yeah, we've got three of these lateral pull-downs right now. We're going to set these up. Honestly, probably on the back wall here, or this, this wall here as well. Yeah, see, like this one, you could definitely... Uh, or does this get switched? From Yeah, I think I get switched from the front side too. Okay. So again, we're going to give them some ample space. There's no need to uh, be having stuff super cramped in here. There we go, we got all that. I think I might get one more of those as well. Just so we got four of each of those. And uh, we'll see, what else do we have here? So we got a couple of the row machines, we got three of those. We got some bench presses, which we're probably going to get a couple more of each of the... Well, we got another bench. Yeah, we'll probably do like two more of those bench presses. We'll do another row machine. Probably do a couple more of these bicep curl machines. Unfortunately, these... The Smith machine, this bicep curl machine, and I think um, a couple more of these were added in late. So we don't really give an ample space for those either. But uh, yeah, we'll do another row machine. We'll do, where's the level three bench press? There it is. We'll do, I think, was it two more of those or was it just one more? So we've got two there, one there. Yeah, so we'll do one more of those then. Just we got about four of each of those, and then we're going to do one more of these lateral pull-downs for that. Which, it's already 6.30. We're going to already have people coming in here pretty soon. This is kind of crazy. <laughs> but, um, yeah, we got lateral pull-downs. Get uh, one more of these placed in there. There we go. Yeah, I probably could give a little more space between those. But that's alright. Okay. So, we got these row machines. Let's get uh, these placed down. Again, we're giving 
ample space. We got one more of the, or actually, oops, I purchased one too many of these. I guess I didn't need another one, but that's all right. Okay, I guess we'll get uh, that. We'll just place it down. Why not? There we go. We get all that. Okay, we're starting to fill up the space. I was a little nervous about trying at the beginning about trying to get all this this whole space actually filled up, and it's coming together nicely so far. Uh, let's see here. Wait, do I have? Oh wait, the bench press is at end. Which honestly, the bench presses maybe could go on this wall over here. Since we kind of have, we're going to have some weights over there. Let's do that right there, which we're not going to really get all of these in here if we. Hmm. Well, maybe we can. I'm trying, like I said, I'm trying not to get uh, things too cramped. But honestly, that actually is pretty good. Okay. I like that. And like I said, we'll have all the weights over there, which maybe I'll do. I think we're going to do just one more over here. Even though I'm kind of doing fours of most things here. But um, yeah, I think uh, I think that's good. Ooh, I didn't even realize we've got this uh, pec deck, which we're going to want to get a couple more of these too, probably. So we'll probably set these up like this. Maybe just in a line here. Yeah, we'll do like three more of those, I guess. Why not? We'll do four of each. We're definitely, we spent through about half of our money already, so that's great. <laughs> not really, but uh, <coughs> sorry guys, I'm still uh, still getting over this little cold thing that I have here, which it's almost gone at this point, so I'm, I'm feeling good. It's just a little cough here and there in my throat. I can feel a little something every now and then, so it's not too bad, but uh, how, did our get, how did our gym get dirty already? There shouldn't be anybody in here. Even though I know the doors aren't closed, but uh, that's all right. Oops. I was just trying to look up to see like if we needed like more space around these. So I think this is just a machine that you're just sitting down on it only and basically like working out like this way, like this. So I think we're good on that. Okay. We got these uh, Smith machines, which we've got two of. Oh, that's probably where I missed, where I got an extra row machine, because I didn't notice, like, the times two on that. Which these, we're going to want some good space around, so I don't know how many of these we'll end up getting with that. So yeah, these are doing, like, um, doing, like, your uh, squats, I think, with, I believe. And it make, would make sense that you'd be, like, like this with it. Okay. Uh, let's see. Oh, we got people in here already. Come on in, enjoy the new gym. Okay. So yeah, we've got these bicep curl machines, leg extensions, and another bite. So we've got two bicep and leg extension, leg curl. Okay. Um. Okay. Let's see here. Yeah, I think I'm going to do two more of those, um, of these right here, because we got extra space to be, uh, taken up. And then, hello, hello, hello. Oh, we got, uh, more people in here checking in. We got to be careful of that now. That's definitely one bad thing with, um, working on stuff upstairs, is, uh, not being able to keep an eye on things down here. But that's all right. Okay. So we are going to get, um, one, two, three... One, two, three. And we're going to get one, two of these, and then probably two more of these. All right. So let's uh, head on upstairs here again. Because, yeah, then I think that other row we're going to put, like, kind of facing the other way, running along here of stuff. So we're going to need two more of these Smith machines. Which, honestly, I'm kind of tempted to push these all back a little bit. Because we've got so much extra space. And we're, if we do another row right here, we're going to have all that extra space right there. So, yeah, I think I'm going to push these back just a little bit. So, that means all of these are going to get picked up here. Okay. So, let's 
Actually, you know what? I'm going to do these here first. I think these are going to go like this. They're a little close to each other. A little closer, actually, than I'd like, I think. Because people are going to be putting weights on these. I hear Hagrid going in already. <laughs> um, yeah, like I said, people are going to be putting weights on these, so they're going to need some room to be able to uh, get those put on. So let's um, do that. Yeah, I think that looks pretty good. Definitely a lot better with the space that we have, because like I said, then we'll do the next row of machines kind of back here like this, facing that way. And uh, that'll give us plenty of room. All right, we got uh, these pec decks to go in now. Something like that, kind of. Keeping everything in a close line. And then we'll get these last three down of these. Something like that, kind of. I think that's pretty good. Kind of slowly coming this way a little bit with the line, but uh, not too bad. Give some nice walking space for everybody. Kind of following a line here of coming in here and then going off that way a little bit. And then you also have some space in between as well to be able to walk around. So that's really nice. The money's starting to roll in already. I love them cha-ching sounds. Uh, let's see here. But yeah, then we've got our all of our other machines kind of go the other way right here. So let's go with the bicep curls. Something kind of like that. And then we'll go down in a line on that. There we go. We got all that. That looks good. Give some nice space for that. We've got uh, the leg extensions. We'll do these next. It doesn't seem like a lot of people are coming up here, though, so I'm not really quite sure on that. I really hope that uh, people can actually get up here. I know I've seen some, obviously, but it's not uh, like it should be. Not with all the equipment that we have up here. And then we've got the leg curls. It's, uh... Get all these added in. There we go. It actually finished off like perfect. And then that gives us some space to be able to walk around. And also we can add some other equipment if some stuff gets added in to the game as well. But uh, let's, I'm going to pick all this stuff up and I'm going to get one more um, weight set purchased. Yeah, look at how nasty this equipment is. But yeah, like I said, I'm going to get one more weight set at, uh, purchased. I'm going to uh, purchase... Probably three more. Actually, I'll just do like four more treadmills. Why not? Why do people love walking through the yoga mats? I don't understand that. So one more weight set, three, like uh, four more treadmills. Yeah, it seems like people aren't going upstairs, so I'm not really sure what um, is going on with that. But... Um, Okay, so we got one, two, three, four more treadmills, and then we've got uh, one more gun bell stand. And then we're going to end up probably doing a whole other line of the uh, treadmills, or not treadmills, the bikes. So we're going to do another... Roll of the, or not, not another roll, but another, another bit of those. And then we're going to get this other dumbbell stand placed down. Get this built out. Right there. I'm just going to move this one over just a little bit. Keep it all looking uniform. Kind of center it right there. There we go. That all looks good. You get a nice view of the city, the water, the lake, or the river, or the ocean, whatever it is out there. Yeah, we don't have a single person using this equipment, so I don't know what's going on with that. Honestly, everyone is down here. There, there's definitely a bug. 
or something with that. So hopefully that gets fixed uh, because obviously that is an issue, which I'm guessing by next time we play this anyways, they'll end up with um, some kind of fix for that. Uh, we're going to go ahead and spend all of our money on... Actually, I might have bought one too many of those. But, um, yeah, because unfortunately people aren't even going upstairs and using the new equipment. Yeah, we bought 18 of them. <laughs> we bought four too many, but uh, that's all right. So, yeah, we're going to do like this. Definitely placing these a little closer than I wanted to ori originally, but um, that's all right. I might end up actually picking up a couple in the middle to create like a walking space for people to get to the back row, but I don't know. We'll see. There we go. Okay. So that is all. I mean, we're all redone now. We got uh, all this down here. I mean, it's more of just like a kind of lobby type entrance with a little bit of like basic aerobics type stuff. I might do another row of yoga mats, honestly, as well, which I don't really have the money for, unfortunately, right now. But, um, yeah, I don't know. I think uh, I might end up just doing that. And then, uh, I think that might be a good, a good point to end off the episode here. And I think this will be the last episode again of this series until we get some sort of update uh, for the game. Because we just don't have, unfortunately, a whole lot that we can, um, we can actually be uh, playing right or doing in the game right now. It's just uh, not a not a ton to do, but yeah, that especially we won't touch this game until they fix whatever bug is going on now with the game itself that people are not going upstairs and using the equipment upstairs, at least how they should be. One, two, three, four, five. Also, Hagrid's like punching people from right here at the desk now. He's just that good. <laughs> he's, he's able to punch them through from here all the way into locker rooms or wherever he needs to. <laughs> it's kind of funny. <laughs> but um okay so we got three more of those i'm gonna get these placed down real quick i need one more of these yeah because like people are leaving already and they're not even not even doing anything unfortunately at the gym because and that's going to start to ruin our reputation i feel like because there technically is not going to be for anything for them to do because they won't uh, use the stuff upstairs but uh, like i said i'm sure that'll get fixed just a probably a simple bug that uh, will be taken care of in the next update since uh, I know the second floor was just added. So I kind of figured there'd be some bugs. We're just going to slap that guy. Get him, on, get him on out of here. Get out of here. <laughs> um, you stank anyways. But um, yeah, so we got uh, all this stuff. I mean, all redone. Like I said, it looks like people are only using the locker room. And I know I saw the people using the equipment over here when they were, when it was just um, piled up in the corner. But obviously you guys can see it's like empty up here compared to um, everything else. But it looks like actually some people are walking over towards the equipment now. So I don't know what um, what's up with that. But I'm like I said, I'm sure it's some little bug that'll get addressed. But um, I think that's going to be a good point to wrap up the episode. I know this one's getting a little bit long here. So thank you all very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to leave a like if you guys did. Show the series some love and support. I see these treadmills are really going that way. <laughs> but um, yeah, that's where I wish you could have like a snap grid type of thing. But uh, like I said, thank you all very much for watching. Leave a like on the video if you guys did enjoy it. Uh, show the series some love and support. I realize we're level 17, almost 18. Kind of crazy. So, um, but yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Catch you all next time. Thank you for all. Thank you all for watching. Peace out.